Move crappy. I'm set up, set up, set up, set up, set up, set up. I'm gonna crop the other video and add it to this. So this is a bit of a cut. Who I make these videos for? I make these videos for the young men that are lost. I make, such as myself, I make the young uh, videos for the young men that are broke, such as myself. And broke is, by the way, like, I'm operating off <laughs> Hamza standard. Jesus Christ. Oops, drop my phone. Don't need to do that. If I could breathe, I'd be a very happy man now, but this breathing is for the rich. Me and my hay fever ass can't breathe. It's bogeys, I'm sick. Pause, guys. No inappropriate rhetoric here. We're totally family friendly. Should I see myself better than this? Oh, yeah, I can. Okay. I make these videos for the young men that are lost, young men that are broke, young men that want to improve but they can't improve. I don't make these videos for the guys that are like super uh, disagreeable and that they, they're so trapped within the entertainment. Like I remember my friend, like during lunchtime I could tell different things. I respect him a lot and I like him a lot but like, I could tell like he wasn't entirely serious about changing his life. Because he always argued for a little bit of downtime, a little bit of this, a little bit of that, a little bit of this. And then it, that little bit of everything, a little bit of entertainment, he watches the show called The Office. Not The Office, um. Not some office show. Not The Office, not The Office, something else. Anyway, he watches like some office show, and then like he kind of justifies, oh, I already did my work for today, so a little bit of this would justify, like, bro, for me, it's all in, all out. Like, I'm video games, all in, bro. All in! You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna post, I'm gonna grind like a fuck ton, reach all my goals, finish, done, boom, bada bing, bada bing, go on to something else. That's the way I approach video. I think that's the way a lot of young men should approach that type of stuff as well. I, I like it a bit, I think, straight up. I don't know, let me, let me try it again. I feel like I can see less of myself, but it's the same, same shit. So I think that. Uh, operating, oh, I haven't started, that's less than £50,000 in the bank account, by the way, or $50,000, $60,000 in your bank account, which is like, less than that is broke in um, Hamza's idea, ideology and that. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. You see the studio, I can't leave the studio, of course. I'll keep my phone on here, it's safe. My setup, I'm leaking the studio. Tablet, me, lights, pointing there with bugs occasionally. You can see the blood of the bug right there. What the hell? The lighting is all weird. What the? There's blood of a bug there. Tablet for reading. That's the only thing I use it for. Yep, straight on a book. Uh, phone for the video. Put a paper. I know what you think, Spider-Man perfume, well, I smell good. My studio. I'm recording. <laughs> so scuffed. <laughs> I make these videos for you, so stupid. <laughs> Desire something greater, desire change. I want young men to watch me on my change, on my come up, and then be inspired by that and think to themselves, yeah, anyone can make it. Like a lot of Hamza's old uni friends that Hamza doesn't talk to anymore, they kind of see him on the come up and they think and they record videos and they say to themselves, hey, yeah, anyone can make it. But then, like, they kind of just disappear off the face of the planet and they don't really upload anymore. Which is like a sign up, you know, beta male kind of thing. And ironically, beta male energy, like a lot of individuals that make a few videos here and there, they, even myself, like 
I haven't been entirely consistent with YouTube videos. I'm gonna upload over the course of a few days. It's gonna be daily uploads every single day. Cause I've been stacking up videos, right? But like, how do I say this? Bro, a lot of individuals that saw, like, that are, that are Hamza's old uni friends. They saw Hamza on the come up. They really did see Hamza on the come up. Oh uh, yeah, by the way, Hamza, I'm going to, you know, uni friends, etc, etc. And then they've seen, like, it firsthand. However, as Hamza keeps growing and keeps grinding on his business, on his work, they kind of just disappear into nothingness. And these individuals, when they do record their videos and you see their faces, you see their reactions, it's jealousy. It's like, oh, wow, you really made it. That kind of feeling. Um, how do I say this? Admiration, jealousy, a bit of envy, not necessarily hatred as well. Perhaps there are some hatred, but there's hatred everywhere on the internet, right? So that's commonplace. But it's usually like admiration, jealousy, and envy. That's the three emotions that's boiled down to have success, which I want you to feel as well. And when you do feel those emotions, you have a positive outlook on those emotions, and you use them and you channel those emotions. You use them appropriately in order to push yourself in order to, to get to the next step. Like Hamza says, 22, 23, that's when a lot of young men get to do what they want. But I'm 17, and I feel like I already get to do what I want. I feel like I have somewhat control of my life. Like if I go, if I go outside, I'm having control of my life. I'm go, go outside, go on a walk, and I start skipping, etc., etc. And I have control of my life in that sense. Do I not? And if I go to my gym session and I miss the gym session, like I have control of everything in my life. Everything's my fault. And I, th I want young men to adopt that men mindset, that mentality, and see my see me on the come up, and see myself like go from zero to hero, right? Classic hero's journey. That's my I, that's my intention with this channel. That's my intention going forward with my own personal brand. I think it's very, very valuable to have something like that in place. <sighs> wow, I could breathe in my nose. It was nice breathing my nose. I'm having a sharp feeling when I suck a mute. My neck hurts. I was doing neck um, curls, not neck curls, but like um, hanging neck curls, and then I don't know. My neck been hurting for a while. It's been sore for a while. So I'm gonna leave it. I posh this shit as well. I should fix that as well. That's why I make these videos. That's why I do this YouTube channel. I look stupid. I look goofy. No, oh, fuck it. <laughs> what noise just came out of my mouth? Like if I show you my posture right now, you would laugh. Okay, yeah, show you my posture. Is the jawline even there? Ow. The spot here, man. There's a bug right there, dude. You see this right here. What are you doing, bug? That's why I make this channel. That's because it's, it's mostly for young men. Um, I really can't speak about women's issues. The best advice I can give to a girl is like, don't be a hoe. Don't be going through your whole phase, taking a bunch of dick, etc., etc. That's fucking retarded. Um, that's generally like smooth brain brain. You can see, oh, you, you can't use all word. I literally don't care. That's retarded. The whole phase is retarded. I'm trying to find a man that is worthy of it. Um, I don't particularly disagree with that conditionally submissive thing. There are a lot of people that disagree with it. And they're usually all right. They have this uh, basic uh, thing, evidence to support it. But I think Beeson is the right man. Something like that. Try to find the right man. And don't stop looking. You know, don't be a hoe. You know, oh, he's kind of nice, so honestly. Oh, shit. Don't do that. It's, hard, it's difficult to not fail. Like a 22-year-old, like 24-year-old, 24, 24 25-year-old virgin. Very, very valuable. That's a high value woman in that sense. I, still, I think that's a high value woman. But yeah, you can, you can disagree with that, and I'm prepared to argue against that and hear your logic out. Myron says, the only such thing as, there's no such thing as a high value woman, there's only such a thing as like a high value, the only, there is no such thing as a high value woman, there is only such thing as a high value woman when there is a high value man beside her. 
and I would disagree. I think a very, very gorgeous 9 out of 10, 9.9 .9 out of 10 woman as a virgin, that's like 22, is a very high value woman. She could get places that no person could possibly fathom. She could go with to Elon Musk, motherfucker man. She could slither her way to Elon Musk with that power. It's crazy. Um, yeah, that's the unfair advantage that women have, and you know, so yeah, I don't give a fuck. I don't really care, so um, I don't know why you. Forty-four a.m. I got the fake Apple Watch. It's fake, guys, but it gets the job done. That's what it was. What someone said about it. So I'm all gets the job done. I prefer the real one, but yeah, fuck it. That's who I make this channel for. Anything else I need to say? I don't know what else. Leave me the okay, Bye. Bye. What the? I'm an NPC, bro. I'm a, I'm a, I haven't taken.